application product specialist, and I'm going to take you through the boom function controls on a liquid system. So on the hydro handle, we have, we'll start off with the left switch here, which is our boom tilt. So I have my left and right up and down tilt functions, so I can operate them individually. If you go to the center of the switch, you'll be able to operate both left and right tilt up and tilt down at the same time. To the right is our main mast up and down switch. This allows me to run the entire boom up or down. It also has the double click functionality when you're using auto leveling. So I can double click down or double click up to operate those functions. And here you can disregard the icons that are on the left and the right as they are not used. Now down on the armrest we have our manual switches for our tip folds and our boom swings. So to manually unfold the booms, we will first fold out the tips while the booms remain in the rack. And then we'll come up and we'll lift the left and right booms up out of the cradles. And we'll come down and we'll swing the left and right boom out together. Once they're behind the machine, we can come up to the mast lower the mast down to the spray position. You can level them off or double click to engage your auto leveling. So over on the side here we have the white switches that pertain to our boom folding. The first one is our auto fold switch. This allows us to fold the booms out and fold the booms back in with one button press. So to fold the booms out you will press and hold the switch until the booms get all the way out. At any time you need to stop, you can let go of the switch, the boom motion will stop, and you can go back to the switch and they will continue from that point on. Same on the fold in. Next to the auto fold switch, we have our hydraulic boom breakaway return switch. This is used in any event that the full boom breakaway has been tripped and not returning itself back to the spray position. For example, if it tripped while traveling uphill. If you need to get that boom back to the spray position, it's as simple as tapping on this switch until you see the boom come back up to the spray position, then let go and continue normal operation.